Hey guys, how are you doing? My name is Tracy and I'm with um, Dixieville Paints here on, live on their page. I am from Tracy's Fancy and I'm a guest here with them. I'm a brand ambassador and use their products every single day on my projects. And I have invited you guys here um, and they have been good enough to have me tonight to discuss how to add whimsy to your furniture. Um, so many of us are painting furniture nowadays and doing furniture flips and uh, we find inspiration continually on Pinterest and Instagram and Facebook, but sometimes um, things start to look a little bit the same. And I think it is so important to find something that sets your piece apart. And sometimes that can be pa a pattern, it can be a special color or a special way to use a paint, or it can be um, mixing colors and patterns together or doing multiple patterns, but a lot of you guys are afraid to do that. So I'm here today to... All right, we're back on. <laughs> Yay, are we back on? Back Yay, on. That, was, that was the longest <laughs> disconnect ever for me. <laughs> sometimes um, we have everything off, but sometimes it just will drop. And if you wait it out instead of jumping off, it works and we waited it out and that was a long time. I was just about to push cancel. Thanks for hanging in there with us. So let's get started because we have a we have a lot to do. Um, can you see the whole piece in, in the picture? No, um, no. All right, let me tell you, I'm gonna get down here for just a second, y'all. Um, this piece is not finished, it's in the works, so no judging, please. <laughs> Unless you have something fabulous to say about it. Uh, this is a hope chest. Um, you can see here that opens up, it's a cedar chest. It's Smells very heavily of cedar. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful piece, but it has had a lot of wear and tear. Um, when I got it, it was painted a, an awful uh, bubble gum Pepto-Bismol pink. Um, it was pretty dinged up and it had a sealer, I think had been used on top of it um, that had started to yellow. So it was pretty ugly. Um, so what did I do to this piece already? Um, and babe, don't move the camera too much because I don't want to lose connection. <laughs> um, what I've done to the piece is I just cleaned it really, really well. Um, I used, oh, I didn't bring any over here. I, I used the White Lightning by Dixie Bell. It's a really, really good cleaner, um, and I, it t brought off some nasty, nasty gunk. Um, and then I wanted to prime it. So the sides are actually primed. The whole thing I primed um, embossed primer, and I used the white because I needed to color block. I knew that I was gonna be doing a black and white Harlequin on the top, so uh, where the white Harlequin is, I did not want any of that pink showing through, so I color blocked it with um, one good coat of the Boss Primer in white. Um, I coated the entire piece in that. Now, right now, it's already got a coat of fluff, which is, yes, babe? Emily says we're out of focus. Is it looking any better, Emily? Sometimes it just, I don't know, some people don't mess with anything. Okay. Do we look clear on your camera? If we look clear on your camera, then a lot of people are seeing us clear. Yes. Yes? Okay, good. Sorry, Emily, I'm sorry. Um, it's clear on our end. I don't know what to say. There's no way we can really fix that. Um, anyway, this, I also, I also used Fluff. It's my favorite white. It's kind of like the color of marshmallow, which I think must be why they named it Fluff. Um, and this has a coat of fluff on it here already. So I wanna tell you a little bit about the colors that I used on the front. Um, and the, like I said, this is not the finished product, although I really, I think, it, I think it looks really good already. I think it looks good on camera and in the light. Um, I don't know if any of you have, what is our TV thing, babe, Roku? Is that what we're, it is? A lot of people are, are a little blurry. Uh, yes, Roku. Roku. Um, a lot of people are blurry. I don't uh, know. We've had three or four people mentioning it. Oh, I am so sorry, you guys. Um, anyway, Roku is a, a TV thing that we use. I don't even know what you, what you would call that. A streamer for live streaming, yes. I guess. Um, and they've had this backdrop or a screensaver that's been, uh, they've been using on the TV. And every time I walk through the family room, I'm stopped in my tracks because of these colors. And I kept saying to myself, I want to put that on furniture. It's the colors of the sunset, but it's way more vivid. And um, so I took a picture of it and I decided I would use that. And I got out here today. I just did this today. Um, and I did the front of the piece only. This down here, we're going to stripe if we have time after we work on Harlequin on the top. Um, we're going to stripe this drawer. This is a drawer here that comes out like this. Um, so I, I wanted to tell you what colors I used here. Uh, Dixie Belle has a really pretty dark purple called Amethyst, but I didn't have any Amethyst in stock. 
So I made my own purple by mixing, like a chemist, <laughs> I mixed um, red and blue. I mixed cobalt blue and honky tonk red, which are two very, very vibrant colors. So can you believe that, y'all? Can you believe that these two colors made this outer color on the outside? And it just, it made this gorgeous purple and I just love it. So I used the red, the red and the blue. Oh my gosh, he's giving me a heart attack. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> What's that? Just don't glasses. move, babe. Don't move. Um, and then I also used peony, which is a beautiful, beautiful, not bubble gum, not Pepto-Bismol. It's a gorgeous pink. I used that in these areas. I color blended with water. And then I also used Flamingo, which is what I used here in the center. And then this down here on the bottom is also Flamingo. So those are the four colors. So that's four colors that I used to make the center. And I'm really pleased with it. So you guys let me know what y'all think about it. And Matt, do you, did you want to say anything? No, nope, I'm good over here. <laughs> okay. So then what we are going to work on right now. Okay, we're back. We're back on? We're back. You know what? Um... I'm thinking we might need to move you guys. Do you, no, I think what we'll just move now. You want to get reset up? How do you guys feel about this? Do you feel like that? Can, can y'all see us clearly? I don't. I do lives um, like two and three times a week, so I don't know why we're having issues today. 